Welcome to one of my first game guides on English. Uh, I'm gonna explain a concept that I haven't saw explained in any other guide before, and it's about how the buffer system affects cancelable abilities like Ruchoryuken or Hadoken or different abilities. In simple terms, the buffer system is an action that is stored in memory of sort. Uh, and when if you do an action and you do a upcoming action before the animation end, the system is stored in memory so the action is executed as soon as it, as it can be executed. This affects cancelable movements like Choryuken. Why? I'm gonna show you an example like that. that's really 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 simple. If you dash and do down tilt into the Hadoken input, you're gonna get a Chuchuruken. Why this why this happen? Because when you dash the forward movement is a store in buffer and when you do the Hadoken input it's gonna do a true Chuchuruken. This uh, to understand this is very very usable useful because uh, you can cancel things like dash and rising up tilt into true Choruken really really fast and you can do it with Terry as well and with uh, Ryuan Ken uh, it works better with Ryuan Ken since they are more fast uh, than Terry but still uh, it works really really well you can do as well uh, that down tilt into Ryuken really fast and of course even down tilt into Choryuken but it is more useful for the uh, upper and uh, that's a down tilt I hope uh, it helps someone uh, to execute better movements with Ken and get you more straightforward execution of the cancelable ability